What's up, everybody? Welcome to The Last Days of Warcast. We are Southern California-based band, The Last Days of War. I am Mark. I'm Rob. I'm Danny. Beats and beats. And first on the agenda, boys. Shots. What are we drinking today? Oh, Danny said, fuck, cheers. <laughs> fuck it, we just going. We just going today. Do you want to do you want to hear a little a little story I did one night? <clears throat> so I went to uh, Buddy's house and we were watching some boxing matches and we were drinking. <laughs> He's just trying to hold he it in right now as long as he can. And so uh, we're hanging out, tequila shots were poured, and all these dudes were sitting around just bullshit and talking. So while they're talking, I just started pounding every single shot. And it was, it was cool because it was this moment of like, yeah, my God, like I just took eight shots and then, and then blackout drunk happened. I think we were playing songs on the piano at 3am and shit like that. That's crazy, dude. That's, that's a lot of fucking shots in a row, dude. Yeah, it was. I, 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 uh, I didn't handle eight shots of tequila in a row like that as well as I would have hoped. (laughs) As I would have hoped? I wound up with with a bottle of Jack Daniels, like this spot size bottle, mm. tipped over on my trash can because I was trying to get in the house. I wound up having to knock on the front door, and then the next morning I woke up on the floor of the bedroom. Uh, we've, just so, been, we've just been informed. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the last day of the forecast. <laughs> I'm Rob. <laughs> I'm Mark. <laughs> Danny. Fuck, dude. Here um, we go. Round two. Yeah, man. Uh, <laughs> Like they want to talk a little new music real quick. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's what do, do we got? That. Uh, so, uh, I mean, it came out a, a couple of weeks ago now, but the the new Poppy and uh, Bad Omens. Bad Omens. Yeah, I was. Van. Almost, Put a question mark uh, at the end of that. The question mark. Yeah, I almost got it confused with Sleep Token. I almost said Sleep Token. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, song's Bad called Token? Van. Uh, what'd you think Sleep of it, Rob? You uh, it? I thought it was a good song. Yeah. Liked it. Yeah. 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 Um, I know Poppy. Is more on the poppier side. You don't say. I don't know, right? Her name Get the fuck out of here. Uh, but this is a good mix. This is a good mix. It's up there with um, a lot of them. Yeah, a I them. I love all of what Poppy does. So when yeah. I heard that they did a song with Bad Omens, I immediately was like, I need to hear the shit. Yeah, and they didn't miss a point. It's fucking awesome. Yeah. What'd you think of it? I like the drummer. I. Can't say that I'm really a fan of the whole Poppy band, but their drummer is really solid. So I followed the band because of the drummer. I like his ideas that he adds to the music with the double bass, yeah. but still keeps her back pop beat that she likes. Right. And the electronics they throw into it are cool. Yeah. Yeah. That man, that, that shit's dope. Uh, I yeah. like the uh, the kind of poppy, <clears throat> kind of metal, industrial kind of. You talking element. about the band or the style of music? The style. <laughs> style. Well, just the whole, the song in general, the, the, the whole band, thing, those, yeah. yeah. I yeah. first heard about Poppy through wrestling, actually. She had did a song for like an NXT pay-per-view or something like that. Uh, I heard about her through the seeds uh, because you can't pass a drug test if you have a bunch of them. You See got that? there. That was, yeah. That yeah, was, that was a good. stretch. That was good. But you're you with got, me on that. I got you, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Fantastic. Thank We're you. We're all on board with that one. Oh, thank you. <laughs> He's here all day, folks. <laughs> Tip your waitress on the way out. But, yeah, man. Um, do you want to say anything else about Poppy, really? Or, you good? You all popped out? I liked it. Yeah. Yeah. She was dope. What, that's what I got. Listen to Poppy, man. That's yeah. what we're saying. That's what we're trying to get across here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, so, last week, we did a little bit of the Would You Rathers at the end of the episode. And we still have quite a few of them to go through, and I thought it would be cool to still go through a few of those right now. Would you rather? Would you rather? So, uh, <laughs> would you rather, Rob? This would be an interesting one. Would you rather? <laughs> would you rather be able to whisper everything or shout everything for the rest of your life? What? <laughs> I'm sorry to all the listeners out there for that one. <laughs> would you rather shout? I mean, you, you kind of do that already, right? Huh? You know what's surprising surprising about Rob is that for as like loud and angry and screamy he gets in music, he's a pretty soft spoken dude. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, for the most part. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh Ooh, yeah. Gets a little sexy. So you're gonna shout? No. You'd rather whisper everything? Oh yeah. yeah. We just we just whisper everything. <laughs> sweet, sweet nothing. What would you rather do, Josh? Whisper I'm or shout? You're whispering. I'm whispering. Oh yeah. 
Because I don't talk that much anyway, so Welcome I'm going to shout. the dark side. Yeah, I think I'd go yeah. whisper, dude. There's See just certain I'm things saying. you don't need to be shouting. Yeah, we don't need to be shouting and wasting so much energy. I go with no. whispering. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Welcome to the dark side. Come on. <laughs> you going to whisper on that one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Read the are. next one, Danny. Welcome to Whisper Yeah, we are all just whispering. Go ahead and whisper this next topic. You know what? Whisper the next one, Rob. I don't even know where we're at. The fucking the horse-sized duck one. What? Oh, yeah, we doing that one. Yeah. What size what? Would you rather fight one horse-sized duck? Or a hundred duck-sized horses. I feel Dude, like I'm taking a, a hundred, a hundred duck-sized horses. I feel like a fucking horse-sized duck could possibly Fuckers fuck you up. Fucker's gonna snap your I head think, off, I think that thing could possibly fuck you up. Because certain, like, ducks and geese are already pretty aggressive. You know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> like, they, yeah. They already want to fucking I think, throw down. I think a duck yeah. that size could probably fuck you up pretty good. Yeah. I, uh, I think got? I'm going with those little tiny horses, dude. But a hundred of them, yeah. a hundred of them, a hundred <laughs> of them. How many you think you can fight off until? There's the just day? one fucking horse-sized duck. Is that just a regular sized duck? We team? don't know. We don't know. It could be. Would a, you try to ride it? We don't know what kind <laughs> of horse duck this is. It, would I try to ride it? I yeah. would try to make it my friend first of all before I tried to kill it. Before I tried to eat it. All right, so, here, you're either my friend or you fucking die. What are you? What are you doing? What are you? You're I taking. Think, I, I think I'm going the. Are smaller... we trying to break in a horse sized duck, or are we trying to make a bunch of horse uh, duck sized horses <laughs> be our friends? Like you trying to befriend a hundred little fucking horses? I don't. So well, my little ponies. But the like, question isn't. Totally the, 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 the question fight. isn't. The question isn't. Do you befriend these? Are you gonna fight them? Is what the question. You gotta fight them. Fuck that. So, I'm gonna befriend it and sell it. I think. Uh, okay, the duck is gonna. The duck or shit? ducks are gonna eat you. What are you gonna do? Which one do you want to take on? Um, uh, I'd I, probably take. I. I mean, I probably don't have much of a chance winning, but I think I had a better odds of fighting one giant duck and then a bunch of tiny horses. Fucking. Well, that's a good fucking answer. How'd you come running up and one? fucking kicking you in the shins and shit. You know what I mean? But they're like small. I just boot them. But how but many? Of how them. many are you gonna kick until you fall over and then they trample you and they attack you like those little green? Yeah, but they're the really part? small. The like, <laughs> like, I mean, they're just small. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, pack a punch. I'm telling you, a duck the size of a horse is gonna eat your fucking head, dude. You're gonna be dead. That's it. It's but gonna it's kill one you. of them. It's one of them. I think you have a fighting chance against a hundred. A swarm, yeah. a swarm of baby horses. I ain't horses. trying to fucking fight a big old duck. Like we're talking Clydesdales? What are we talking? <laughs> Am I wearing <laughs> boots? It's fucking horse, yeah. you know? I, I feel horse, like if I'm at least wearing a composite tail, I'll Let's just safe. take your average size horse, whatever that is. Yeah. A Clydesdale? Those that, are I magnificent. That's, that's, that's average, though. They're, they're glorious. Not, they're fucking huge. Yeah, no, man. Uh, Clydesdale. Right. What about you, Josh? What are you doing? I'm taking the one duck. Taking the one, see, for it. He thinks the one duck too, man. You can't take on a hundred little duck sized horses. I don't, I'm afraid of little people. <laughs> you see my wife. Mm -mm, little ones are mean. I'm taking the one big ass duck. Hear me out, pal. You did the one thing you're afraid of and put your dick in it. <laughs> that is called conquering your fears. Hey, that is <laughs> called conquering that your is fears. Bravery. <laughs> this man. You know what that's called right there? Put that's called a table. man. That's a man. That's a man right there. Be a man. There. Not be a once, man. Be twice. Videos. Be a man. Put your dick in something you're scared of. <laughs> yeah. Be a man. Be a man. Be a man. I love those videos, dude. Uh, um, let's go. Let's go with the next one, man. <laughs> fucking. There's another one. Yeah, there's another yeah. one. There's a few. Uh, oh. Let's go. Fucking. Would you rather live without the internet or live without air conditioning and heating? I'm gonna go without the internet on that one. Really? Yeah, dude. <clears throat> no, no. Uh, I'll take AC and heating. Without it, you mean? Yeah, no. Like, I, for, hear me out. I've kind of already Listen. checked out on one social media platform, but I'm still active on another, which kind of connects to it. So I'm just like, that's about as much activity I'm gonna put into that. You know what? You see what I'm saying? For like the, for so, the for the betterment of this band, for me to still have internet access to promote this band, I'll say no AC and no heating. <laughs> I'll take the hit. Guys. You'll take the hit. I'll take, I'll the, take hit. the video of me and some AC and be like, 
<laughs> you guys should watch some last days of war videos. Now back to Mark. No, back to oh Mark. my god, we're gonna die. You guys should watch this you? video. Do we still get like uh, other technology like DVDs and shit like that? Yeah, it's, oh, just, yeah. it's just the internet's gone. So you couldn't so, do Netflix, oh yeah, but, but you, you could still. But you can't stream them. Yeah, I know, but you could still like, you know. Yeah, I mean, you can still have TV. You still, I mean, you still have like. Uh, yeah, anything without. Physical, you still have cable. Medium. No Wi-Fi. Right? No, no Wi-Fi. No Wi-Fi. No wi-fi. So but you as could long do, as your cable doesn't run on Wi-Fi, I guess you're you, good. Yeah, cable don't. I mean, not all of it. My Fortnite is plugged so you're going into internet. the modem. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Sold. Let's go. Sold. Let's go. What about you, Josh? I'll give it all up. Give it all up, dude. That's why. No, I'd have to have heating in there because of my family. Got a lot of cold-blooded people in my house. What do you do, Mark? I already answered. Did you? What'd you answer? <laughs> What'd you answer? I didn't hear him answer. I said, I, would, I said for the betterment of the band. So He's going to keep the internet. I'm going to keep the internet, and I'll take the hit on not having AC and, and, and the heat. And then what'd you pick? I said, well, since he's getting the internet, I'll take, I'll, I'll. So uh, everyone else picked everything else. And you've just been left. here for the whole episode, right? <laughs> <laughs> and we're back. I am Rob. And we're back. Oh, boy. <laughs> Let's go one more. What do you got, Danny? Oh, oh which one are we out here? Top um, one right there. Would you rather eat only pizza for every meal or never be able to eat pizza again? Never be able to eat pizza again. There's so many better foods than pizza out there. I'd rather be able to eat all those. What you got, Rob? I've never wanted to move my seat more. And, <clears throat> and I don't know why I'm still sitting here. Like, wow. Really? Yeah, man. It's so you're saying you would eat pizza every day? Every day, bro? Think yeah, about it. Yeah, but different types of pizza. There's different types of pizza. You can have thin crust. You can have... The fat crust. Rob's like, I put fucking ice cream on my he's pizza. Like, he's like, you got shrimp soup, shrimp salad. Oh, well, hang shrimp, on. There are ice cream pizza. You got pizza soup. Pizza soup. Fucking pizza Tell salad. me ice cream pizza, pizza ain't pockets. a bad idea. Like, you layer it dope, like man. a fucking <laughs> choco taco. Like, Just... <laughs> Ice cream yeah. pizza? Ice cream pizza, but you layer it like a choco taco. I feel like you've done this. Have you had that before? <laughs> Hit me up. We're doing this. Hit me up. Last days of Chaco Taco. <laughs> We're gonna make this, I'm going to make this a day. And, it, and it's, it's a Chaco pizza. <laughs> Slice of pizza. Oh, man. I feel like I get pretty tired. I mean, I already like... It's it's like... Get tired it's of pizza like pretty those, quickly. Uh, what is it? Brennan's, Bro, there's whole groups of food. Brennan's you give ice cream yeah. cakes yeah. where you're like layers of chocolate and ice cream, layers of chocolate, ice cream, layers of chocolate. And you're just like, holy shit. This is amazing. But they're like 10 bucks each. And you're just like, I feel ashamed if I eat one to myself. And you're like, but you eat a $5 fucking pint from the gas station and it's two for five. So you just paid the ten ninety nine and you pay the tax. What about you, Josh? <laughs> 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 How far is the story gonna go with this ice cream right now? Know you, Josh. Like, he's he's taking me on that trip with the muck gas station. We, we, we had, bro. I'm with you. Josh, like, oh, pizza. Sure. Pizza, 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 like, yeah, I, I love fish. Think about all Italian the food, food Mexican food. And yeah. you can't cheat and be like, just throw it on top of a pizza. That's yeah, you can't be like, <laughs> you can't do that, dude. You, you can't be like, check, you can't this be like out. check out this pizza and hamburger. It's a pizza burrito. burrito. This double double pizza. <laughs> like, <laughs> you can't tell me I can't do that <laughs> shit. Dude, I did it out. It's double double the pizza double. Rob's like, don't tell me what the fuck to do. Here's what I'm going to do some Juanitas and it's Juan pizzas. Like, it's just like I got three chicken taco uh, cabaneras, and, and you're just like, oh. Uh, I will say that Pizza Hot Pockets are fucking bomb, dude. God yeah. damn it. We went over these nuclear pockets over before. Yeah, we have. Yeah, we're yeah. not doing this. For I sure. don't want to do this. This yeah. is gross. A nuclear pocket? Okay. Yeah, a nuclear pocket. Like, let's be honest. It's that like pepperoni. microwave it for a minute 30. <laughs> And you're just like two minutes just to be on the safe side. Hey Rob. <laughs> hey Rob, 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 would you rather live in a utopia as a normal person or a dystopia 
but you're the supreme ruler. Um, I feel like I live in the latter. <laughs> but you're not the supreme leader. <laughs> He's like, just wait. He's like, just wait, dude. Just he, wait. He Hang could on. be. Hang on. Uh, I'll we, be right we back. Put all these thoughts on pause, right? We can pause it. <laughs> we we can just pause, pause it. it, and then <laughs> hang on, and then I'll run off screen, and then we unpause it later, and then we'll be like, "Hey, this is the unpause." You know what I'm saying? So which one? The ladder. Okay, she's gonna climb the ladder, bro. What you got? You gonna? I feel like you want to be up a supreme ruler, bro. No, I want to live in a utopia as a normal person. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I think I'd go if, with that one too. If that was the option, that's what I would choose. Yeah. You know? I don't want to be in charge of anything, dude. You know what I mean? Yeah, especially not a dystopian. I'm man. already, you know, too many responsibilities feeding my kids every day. Doug. You ain't got to feed them every day? Fuck. <laughs> you feed your kids every day? <laughs> what the fuck? I I like, you, Josh. Dude, I let my Sims die. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> Rob puts his Sims in a pool and takes away the ladder. That's what he does. He just lets them drown. <laughs> I build walls. Are you kidding me? Get out of the pool. Set them on fire. <gasps> oh, Rob's out here building walls. Goes to Texas once. Fucking fucking hell. Yes, holy shit. What is Rob's problem? Yeah, just, where do we start? Uh, what you got, Josh? I'm going with Utopia. Yeah, man. See, we're all peaceful dudes, man. You know. Yeah, I mean? it would be nice, right? But it's like, hey, Supreme Leader is going to launch himself oh, into but space. Not want to be a part of you guys. Don't get it. Wait, don't why? get it twisted. No, it don't matter. If it wasn't a Utopia, if the option wasn't that, then I would be like, fuck you. I'll be the Supreme Leader. Then y'all can fucking fuck off. Yeah, right. Yeah. But, the, but if it was, if right it was way. literally like, fucking that, I would take, I would take it. But otherwise, I'd be like, he's, yeah, I'll he's be in charge. Just like, I'm gonna fucking just deuce out later. Do so? like, Do you what? think that instead of wars, that like the world leaders said, like if we got beef, like just the presidents fight each other and. That's it. Because I think that if they did that, then we would have some pretty cool presidents. Dude. I think we would you have I mean? less presidents to worry about. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, you know. Yeah, dude. But not just some like UFC fighter. Yeah, but then you'll, get, <laughs> then you'll get some fucking douchebag. You know what I'm saying? That's you get true. some fucking. Some fucking roided out and shit. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think no, we would just they gotta trade. Be, they got to be legally born U.S. citizens, right? Like at that point, because it's still presidential. like Presidential rules. Like, you have to be born a natural born citizen. You couldn't be Arnold Schwarzenegger or a and be a president. Born killer. See? Might become more in handy. What? What? A natural born killer? Yeah. Who would it, you, you know elected? what? Instead of a fight, I would rather have a, a battle of intellect. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's, let's fucking. But we're losing that one every yeah. fucking. Yeah, time. but I mean, it, it would clear the ballot coming and it would be wonderful, right? You would think, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's what they're supposed to be doing. Hey, that's the problem. Like, I'm, just gonna, I'm gonna lie. Like, that's what's supposed just, to happen. You know, just it's not what happened. Fuck. And then we like, could just, just call this thing. and street cred. Like, oh, sleepy Brandon. You're like, oh god damn. Bro, what let's just these... let's just let the fucking AI run it. Oh you damn, know? dude. Oh man, dude. I, I mean, I think we're we're almost there. I mean, AI like, Chester, bro. Fuck. AI president. Yeah, there you go. Go back. Last episode. Go back and watch. The miscellaneous U.S. president. <laughs> it's a laptop. It's a fucking they laptop. fucking go to the fucking WWE. So based on that theory that I said, the who Jim would you Ritter. nominate to be like a president that knowing that they got to throw down with other world leaders? Stone Cold Steve Austin. Wait, you're saying throwing down like you're going yeah, to like world, fight? Yeah, world leaders are fighting instead of sending armies. It's like... We got beef with fucking for, for like, so like right now would be fucking Putin and Biden. We live in <laughs> we live in the United States, so yeah. we're saying we're gonna choose who that representative. Choose would somebody be. from the United States to represent the United States in a fight against another country. Fuck. It's Chuck Norris. Y'all, everyone's trying to fucking nominate the fucking Rock. In the Euro, nah, you're saying, bro. You're saying uh, who? dude, there's Who'd there's say? some kind of fucking SEAL Team Six dude Chuck that'll Norris. just. Fuck up the rock in a second, dude. It's gotta be just a random dude, right? He'll pull out some Krav Maga and kill him in a second. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. That guy. That guy. Yeah. His name's probably Chuck Frank. Frank, we're looking for you. Frank. 
Frank, Frank Norris. Fuck him up, dude. Frank we Norris. believe in you. Frank Norris, dude. Chuck Norris is little brother. What? <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather fight a horse-sized Chuck Norris <laughs> or a fucking a <laughs> or a duck-sized fucking <laughs> Joe Rogan or a duck-sized Joe Rogan or a hundred duck-sized Joe Rogan Joe-sized or duck Rogan's duck-sized Joe Rogan's Joe Rogan, check this out. What do you what do you take a fucking horse sized Joe Rogan or a hundred duck sized Joe Rogans? I'm not fighting a horse sized Joe Rogan, bro. Can you imagine you murder me, a bunch of duck sized Joe Rogans coming out? I don't know if I do any better against a hundred duck sized Joe Rogans, but like. in this case, I would take out the horse sized one just just because it would be fucking funny bro, as hell. Imagine, dude, it'd be wild. You ever seen the videos of that that dude like? Yeah, the kicking, kicking the kicking. Yeah, the bag, he dude? Tra- yeah, oh, he's trained yeah, dude. He's, that. He's he's legit. He'll, How'd that guy fight some he'll people? Kick you, he kicks you in the ribs. You're gonna fucking. You're gonna feel you're gonna that shit. shit out of your fucking. You see that butthole. soccer player that gets kicked in the head and his head turns around? Is that <laughs> is that real? Yeah. It's it's fucking creeped me out for years. <laughs> what? Yeah, I, I call bullshit on that. Rob. No, I swear to God, <laughs> you can watch the video. It'll ruin any fucking childhood dream you ever had. Oh man, you want to talk about childhood videos that ruined us? <laughs> I Fuck can show it. you a world Damn. sex. <laughs> and you're like, Rotten.com oh. was a theme back yeah, then, yeah, bro, and that oh, shit was bro. fucked up, dude. Yeah. That shit was fucked up. I was seeing some shit I was not prepared for. There was there was times I was like, I shouldn't go down this rabbit hole. Why am I go- stop going down this rabbit hole? Stop, I'm like, oh my god, please, yeah, yeah. You just can't stop. Yeah, and then I've done know. that dive, and it's and then the famous. <laughs> we all know the famous execution video that went around when we were younger. Like fucking, which one was that? <laughs> the one that fucked us all up that I can still see if I close my eyes right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she knows what I'm talking about. See, she knows what I'm talking about. Let's do a hot take. Because this last question right there, that one doesn't make any sense to me. Which one? It says, would you rather have your thoughts broadcast uh, so that everyone will always know what you're thinking while you're awake or never be able to wear clothes but not feel cold or hot? What do those two have to do with each other? What do those two have to do with each other? I don't understand. Those are two feelings I still enjoy. Okay. Wait a minute. You know what? Answer it. Wait a minute. I'm okay with having my thoughts broadcasted. I don't no. know, dude. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. I'm bro. fucking Absolutely good with this, not. bro. Well, see, you're, yeah. you're, you, you're, you stand your ground on, like, this is what I think yeah. and fuck you. I'm, I'd so, be like, like yeah. just fucking deal with it, guy. Yeah. Fucking deal with it. You're just like a really fucked up hey. Professor X just talking shit to everybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fucking fuck you. Professor fuck DMX you. and shit. Fuck yeah. it. Hey, so we'll give it to you. Oh no! I would just look uh, at people and just be like, uh-huh. "Man, fuck way uh-huh. for you living on your own. It's gonna deliver to you. Knock, knock, open up a door. It's real." Oh, uh, hey, uh, let's do it. Let's do your Josh. What do you think? I'm fine with the broadcast and your thoughts because half the time I'm not really fucking thinking anything anyway. <laughs> Josh is I'm chilling. just more worried about I'm gonna get in trouble with the wife because she's talking to me and she thinks I'm listening to it. I'm just <laughs> fucking just, off in the other land. Oh, you're you're done. So the second yeah. they have a conversation with you, you better be like taking notes. <laughs> no, I get screwed because then she asked me, right. "Do you remember what and I was talking just, about?" You just like my wife would just like, be yelling at me and she'd be like, "No, I'm not gonna take off my top." You know, <laughs> I'm like, "My bad, that's what I was thinking." You know. She's like, like, is that what you think about all, all the day? Time. Like, yes. Pretty much. <laughs> Good part of it. Bro. Right. Turn on auto captions or don't. Yeah. Real life? I mean, you should. I think always. real life, if real life had Like, like if real captions. life had captions, I wouldn't be staring at your tits half the time. I'd be looking at your belly button. What's that saying? <laughs> 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 but the caption bar would be low, and you're just like, that's unfair for me. And we're gonna, like, we're gonna, oh, fuck. But, like, oh, this is good then if it puts it up high, you walk into it. Let's do Thank a fucking you. hot takes really quick. Hot takes. It's gonna get personal. Hot take. Hot take. Fucking, I like this one. <clears throat> Josh. Hey, yep, I knew it. The Beatles are overrated. Go. Personally, for me, yes. I think so. I respect what they did. It's just wasn't my time era. So for 
a, a Beatlemania fan, I don't understand. But I give credit where credit's due, I guess. The older I've gotten, the more I've the Beatles have grown on me. But if you asked me when I was 20 years old if I would like one Beatles song, I would have said no. We would have fucking fought you right there, dude. Yeah. That's what's up. What about you, Danny? Well, <clears throat> I think without any disrespect at all, I think when you think about it, the Beatles with... You know, when they started with all the screaming girls so and all that stuff. I'm confused by your emotions right now. Like, I don't know what to choose. I think that it's, uh, I think of course they're overrated. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I think it comes with being a famous pop artist. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, yeah, you get a lot of, I mean, anytime they've done <clears throat> something, there's been so much attention on it because... You know what they've done and where they came from. Would they be considered one of like the first big pop bands? Yeah, yeah. I think so. Yeah. I think you would consider them that. Yeah. So, like yeah. I said, they're a pop band. So, yeah. I, I, what pop band hasn't been overrated? overrated? Yeah, you got a point. You know, I think that I think that they had a lot of, especially for their time. I mean, they had a lot of really great music, really good mm -hmm. good songs. It holds up. You know, still a lot of people appreciate their music. So, um, <clears throat> the only time I've enjoyed the Beatles was uh I forget the name of the fucking movie, but where the, the guy wakes up and nobody has any memory of the Beatles. Yes, Joe's apartment. Is it called Yesterday? Is it called, is yesterday? It called yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. That movie's fucking oh. awesome. Yeah. That was a great movie where he's like writing Beatles songs and then I guess Paul McCartney finds them at the end, and stabs them or some shit. I don't remember. What? <laughs> is he really? No, it doesn't. It would have been awesome though. It's but you're fucking up. cool. The Beatles. What blood in blood McCartney. Um No, the Beatles, I they're generational, so it's like you have to appreciate each kind of phase of them. Like the earlier phase, it's poppy, and you're like, all right, I get it. Yeah. She was just 17 or 16, what is it? Where she was young. It doesn't matter. <laughs> and it's like, okay, we, we're going to leave that. Change the lyrics, bro. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to leave that as early Beatles, right? Like, yeah. All right, cool. We're going to ignore that. And but then you, they get into the, like their artistic phase, and each artist split off. And I mean, George Harrison did good stuff. Lennon did great stuff. Yeah, who's that? McCartney. Just <laughs> McCartney did Wings, and that's god awful. <clears throat> I'm not a fan of Wings. Yeah. Just, just like that, okay. huh? Yeah, God, it's got awful. We're going to do one more hot take on that one right there. <laughs> Nicolas Cage is not a bad actor. And he's absolutely correct. Nicolas Cage is fucking awesome, okay? <laughs> Con Air, <laughs> Face Off, <laughs> fucking uh, the other one. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> the other Con Air. Listen, Nicolas Cage is garbage everything before what? Pretty much kick ass i mean kick ass is kind of like borderline when he's getting hit with the tax shit and it's just like all right now i gotta do fucking movies and he's like all right this is what i gotta fucking do but before that it's just like dude you're phoning it in con air was fun uh casey i gotta get casey a little, a little bad Casey in a little bad just trying to get my bro when he gets off the plane in the air trying to get hold of my daughter Trying to get how convicts want to jack the plane. I'm going to hang on. The movie is horrible, but it's why it's so fucking good. I love Con Air. Con Air is a fantastic movie, dude. Yeah. I watch that shit. Anytime fucking Con Air is on, dude, I'm watching that shit, dude. What about you, Nicolas Cage? Bad actor? Good actor? What happened to this dude over here? <laughs> I don't think he's as great of an actor as they say he is. He's not the worst. He does have some decent movies. Well, there's John like Connor. And they switch faces. <laughs> Not like, bad. Movies. That one. You gotta take your face. Not I'm bad. Of his face. I won't put my face on his face. Why? Neither one of you had a good career. Did you ever see Renfield? You're yeah, saying John Travolta did not have a good career? Is that what bro, you're saying? Bro. Grease, bro? Mm. Grease, too. Okay, okay he wasn't in Grease. You go too. from Grease to what? It was after Welcome Back, Luke Cotter. Luke talking, bro? Okay. You forgot there, Urban there's Cowboy. There's a good gap. <laughs> there's a good gap. Okay, so you got the Look Who's Talking franchise. Great movie. Uh, Planet Earth. 
That's Battlefield Earth. Battlefield, Battlefield Earth. Earth. <laughs> I was like, this, yes, that's where we're at. God. That is currently dread, where we're at. Daddy. With the yes. dreadlocks. <laughs> okay, so that now one, we right? sit with bald John Travolta. Like, just... <laughs> that's the one, right? Yeah, yeah. but it's like, where, where do you draw the line and just say, stop? Please stop. Just stop. You, you draw it right here. You guys, this has been the last days of Warcast. Uh, this is our new short form. If you guys are digging it, let us know. Um, check us out. All streaming platforms. Click the link. Buy some merch. We love you. We're out.